Wow, Spencer, this looks incredible. Uh, he had help. Yeah, barely. Well, you both did a good job. Oh, did you see the news about Mika? Yes, I did, and I already put a call into the DA to see what I can find out from him off the record. She cannot get acquitted, Miss Baker. I know. We won't let it happen. I gotta get ready for my lecture. I'll see you on campus, Coop. I can't believe I'm gonna see my baby again. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to hug her. Do you want to pick her up from the airport yourself on Saturday? Oh, you're sweet, Spencer. But I got to see her for Easter. You two have your moment. Or you could come with me. Yeah, Olivia would love me intruding on her romantic reunion. I'll wait, but thank you. What? You tell me. I mean, first the group party, now you're trying to convince her moms to come with you to the airport? Why are you trying so hard to not be alone with Liv? Whatever, I just know I ain't the only one who lost a year with her. And for someone who is majoring in psychology, you having a problem reading yourself. Okay, Freud, what about you? Why are you avoiding telling patients you want her back? When would I have had time to do that, Spence? When I found her bleeding out on the floor? Or on the way in the ambulance? Or No. During the six months she spent in New York rehabbing. How about now? Have you not seen the news? I mean, Patience is still going through a lot. She does not need the burden of my feelings. I think you're shortchanging you and her. The same way you shortchanging Liv? At least I know why I'm doing it. Do you? <laughs>